Okay. We are back. Gout really sucks. It really hurts so much. But I'm better now. Uh, the game for today is called Super Mumtaz Bros. Plumbers, Merchants, and DIY and Chickens. Uh, so this game is a Pico 8 game, which I'm going to look up a little information on that because it comes up now and then. It's very funky. Um, I think Pico 8 itself was actually included in the bundles. Pico 8 is a fantasy console for making, sharing, and playing tiny games and other computer programs. It feels like a regular console, but runs on Windows, Mac, Linux. When you turn it on, the machine greets you with a command line, a suit of con suite of cartridge creation tools, and an online cartridge browser called Splore. So yeah, it's like sort of uh, an NES-like. It, it's programming is fairly similar to an NES or like its output looks like NES, but it's very easy to work with because it's a modern program. It's funky, I like it. Um, I'm gonna check to see if it's in the bundles. Because um, if you wanna buy Pico 8 on its own, I mean, it's not expensive, it's 15 bucks. Uh, yep, yep, Pico 8 is, is in the, uh, was in the Racial Justice Bundle. So if you wanna make games that are like this, uh, the tool for doing so is readily available. So let's get started. Uh, this is one of those games that I did. I, I did the thing again, and I uh, I played the whole game. But I only played easy mode. I haven't touched hard mode yet. Blyle, wake up. Belial, wake up. Ali, what's going on? It's so Oh, wait, it's Monday. We're supposed to be repairing all the plumbing for Princess Sana. Oh uh, yeah, the chickens. How did all those chickens get stuck in the pipes anyway? No idea, but it turns out they're radioactive chickens, so I can use my new Geiger counter to find them. Uh, great. Well, as long as we get all the chickens out of the pipes and repair any other leaks we find, this will be easy. Actually, I kind of spent all of our money on the Geiger counter. But how will we fix the pipes if we have no money to buy new ones? That's okay. Princess Sana says she's left loads of boxes of money lying around for us to collect. It's kind of careless. What if someone stole them from money? She's got her pet snakes guarding it, apparently. Snakes? Why does it always have to be snakes? Oh, ho, 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 ho. The two fellas she asked to do it first didn't like the snakes either. Two Italians, never heard of them. Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> well, they're lost. Well, we better get moving. Great, let's go. Uh, I don't need the tutorial because I already learned how to play this. So basically, this is a game where you control uh, two different characters. Uh, you can also play with two players and have them both operate at the same time uh but it's fine uh so red can detect chickens and green can place pipes so when you uh see the counter going off really hard you break that pipe and a chicken falls out now there are nine chickens left but 11 broken pipes so if you use green and hit x you can replace the pipes but that costs 10 bucks and that is essentially the game I, I wanted to joke that this is, uh, what if Mario was a plumber? But really, it's more like, uh, I don't know, what if Wrecking Crew was a plumber? Because there's no jump button. Any jumping you do is, uh, purely from momentum of, like, climbing up ladders and such. Oops. Controls are a little bit slippery, but they're not bad. Alright, it's better to just go from above. Oh, there is another chicken around here. Oh, that wasn't it. There's plenty of money that you don't need to worry too much about hitting the wrong pipes, but uh, you could run out if you went too crazy with it. So yeah, to jump, you, as it were, you need to just sort of do that little maneuver where you uh, are climbing up the rope and then you let yourself fall off while headed up. 
Because your momentum continues carrying you upwards. Uh, let's take a look, see if there are any chickens here. No, it doesn't look like it. So, I don't actually know how to get down here. Ouch. I got bit. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know how you're supposed to, like, get in there. Uh, that exit's only for once you, uh, collect all the chickens and fix all the pipes. Singing pipes. It seems like, uh, there's like a one block tolerance for maximum detection on the Geiger counter, so it's not super reliable all the time. Uh, there's usually a chicken in one of these pipes, so I guess it's somewhat randomized. I say usually, the one time I did it before, you know. I think it's up above, actually. Or maybe not. Oh, there's one here. So, like, this is all orange. Oh, that's only mo mostly orange? Yeah, it just, it wasn't obvious, you know? But, uh, I do not know how to get through those blocks. There's two buttons, and I'm all out. Yeah, that doesn't work. And... No, it's probably not this one. No. It's just not super precise. There's another. Right there. Also, you don't do anything about the chickens running around. You just let them go. Just let them vibe. Like, here's an obvious secret, right? Barely counts as a secret. But then I don't really know what the what the keys are for. Uh, no tri uh, no chickens in those pipes. And then you can break this one, uh, go down here and get this money. There's a broken pipe up here. There go, got those fixed. Okay, that's what that one was. Uh, 
fine. I just gotta get this one that's sort of in this awkward little spot here that I, you know, sort of just made. There we go. Uh, take another look around to see if there's another chicken in this area. Doesn't look like it. No. Unlock that door, but but why? And where's the other one? Does that not lead anywhere else? It's it's kind of baffling. Uh, yeah, there's another chicken around here. Yep, there it is. And that's uh, its job complete. But it does still leave the question of, like, how do I get that chest? Can't say I understand, but oh well. And now we move on to hard mode. Is this the same? Yep. All right, oh, it's the same map. Uh, you only get $50 per chest now. But do pipes cost more? No, they do not. So is the, oh, there are a lot more uh, broken pipe. That, Pipes and chickens. There's twice as many, in fact. No? Then what is it? Is that? Is it above? Yeah, there we go. You can already see how uh, money problems are stacking up quickly. a secret it seems a little required oh god it's just coming at right at me there we go <laughs> give me the money apparently the snakes uh get along with the chickens just fine as a jump. Yep. It's a very small jump. Ooh, 
Yeah, still don't know how to break those blocks or anything. No, not the snack. Let's get some of these holes filled in, yeah. considerable amount of money and don't have to worry about running out. So what is it over here? important to shower regularly. No, it, it is in that upper area. It just seems like I was always getting a yellow ping. So it's like, it's not, not good enough. Yeah, well, that's where it was. Well, well, bit. I don't know if getting bit actually like does anything bad. Let's get green up there and fix those pipes I just broke. Oops. You're probably not worse than uh, standing next to all these radioactive chickens. Oh, there's another one. And I think it was... Uh, back up in the higher spot. Well, that's what happens when there's twice as many chickens and just a little bit more level. It's gonna be a lot of chickens. Yeah, that was it. Oh, well, now I gotta get green back up there. Chicken in one of these pipes. Yeah. Important machines do not touch. 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 What do these even do? Uh, let's fix those pipes. And I can get this key by dropping down here. Probably good to get those. from that snake by dropping down this way. Oh, I messed it up. Got him! I spent 20 bucks fixing the problem I just caused. The Jimmy Neutron solution. Seems plenty likely that 
I'm going to hit the wrong level for uh, collecting a chicken in these pipes. Nope, not that one. Ah, there we go. We still got squigglies. Oh, that was wrong. That was right. There we go. That's where it was. Patch that up. Get up here. Uh, gotta drop through here to patch this and then go round and round about again Let's see what's up to the right A lot of broken pipes is what there is Let's fix these before I start breaking them. Wrong again! <laughs> seem like it so I continue on this way coffee try 9000 insert coffee all right Get this treasure chest by being a little sneaky, sneaky sneak. It's kind of awkward, the uh, momentum of falling. I don't know, maybe it's subpixels that allow you to do it or not, because it doesn't feel like I'm doing anything that different when I do make it in. Maybe Ellie gets in easier, like, because he's smaller or something. Or I can do it the easy way. <laughs> Got it right that time. All right, well, let's head up. Oh, there's money. Is that really supposed to be a secret? Doesn't seem like there's much in the way of chickens up there. Just one broken pipe to take care of.
I guess there's no chickens in this room either. Uh, no broken pipes either. This room is just A-OK. -okay. Incorrect. That was correct in. Uh, I need to go down here. Right, that's all there. Now let's start going back to the main area. Start picking up the last of the last of the chickens and the pipes. It's always the one you least expect. Sometimes it's the one you most expect. Are those chickens okay? Uh, there's another one around here, probably above. Nope, not that one. First, repair this. Uh, one more chicken. Somewhere. Uh, now time to just run around to Zali until I find it. Oh, I appear to have found it. And uh, pick that one up with Bill. And, uh, and we're done. Job complete. Go to exit. Two out of five secrets. Yeah, well, whatever. Master Plumber. And that's it, it seems. Sometimes they're just short. Pico 8 games do tend to be very short. Because they, they're they made to be, you know, so small. But, I mean, it's a fine little game. Pretty unambitious, but it controls decently well. And it's kind of inventive. I liked it. But I don't have a whole lot to say about it. But uh, I need to work on uh, patching up the schedule and getting that ready for next week. Uh, obviously, I'll play all the things I missed. Continue on with... Uh, Pel Pel Kakekia. Yeah, Pel Kakekia and, uh, and put on a couple new games. And hopefully, I don't know exactly when, but I should be on Don't Make a 